DIP requires schools to remove everything on classroom walls. The recent mandate from the DIP Secretary regarding minimal classroom decoration has sparked contemplation and discussion within the education community. I think there are several benefits. First, reduce destruction a minimalist classroom can help students stay focused on their studies. This can lead to improved academic performance and more productive learning experience. Second, resource allocation by curbing the expenditure on recognition. School can opti optimize the resource allocation addressing critical educational needs by needs that may have been previously overlooked. Therefore, in my opinion, schools and education organization and classroom aesthetics. Such an approach could ensure that the learning environment remains engaging and inspiring while adhering to the principles on equitable education and efficient resources and location. Ultimately, the goal should be to create an environment where students can thrive academically while feeling motivated and inspired by their surroundings. Thank you. The deepest mandate on minimal classroom decoration has prompted a re-evaluation of approaches as educators. While there are valid concerns about the potential impact on inspiration and creativity, a thoughtful and balanced approach can ensure that the learning environment remains engaging, reducing to learners and compliant with the directive. As educators, our responsibility is to adapt and innovate finding creative ways to make the classroom a space where students can thrive academically and creatively. By embracing the challenge of minimalist decoration, we can continue to inspire and motivate our students, nurturing their growth while adhering to the principal and efficient resources allocating and centralized education.